Alabama's first lady has been working on crossing items off her bucket list. Yeah, so today she went zip lining in Gulf Shores at Gulf State Park. That's a lot of fun down it there. Is. Local 15's James Gordon explains how she's doing this to promote state parks this summer. James? Uh, Greg, she did great. Now, one of the zip line tour guides called her graceful, especially when most of us would be shouting or screaming. Take a look. Rain, shine, dangerous or not, it didn't matter. The First Lady Diane Bentley. I was going a little fast, and with the wind and the wet uh, lines, uh, I was coming in pretty fast. The hummingbird zip line at Gulf State Park was the last on Mrs. Bentley's bucket list. Those who zip lined with her today were already calling her the coolest first lady around. Well, let's just say I'm very outside of normal. <laughs> <laughs> Riding with grandchildren on bicycles is about the extreme that I've gone to before. These folks visiting from Shreveport, Louisiana, say the Gulf State Park is already a favorite. It's the third time we've been here, and we love it, too. It's great. It's beautiful. I think it's awesome that someone, and I don't want to say old, but of her age is doing this. I think that's awesome that she's able to come out here and have fun and explore things that the tourists do and that locals do, too. Touring the state, the First Lady has been mountain biking. She's explored Alabama's caves and even taken a selfie at DeSoto Falls. I call them hidden treasures that people aren't aware of. So I thought if I could hit these nine bucket list items and draw attention to them that maybe people will vacation in Alabama or just take a day trip or a mini trip. Mrs. Bentley's awareness campaign is also meant to boost revenue. After all, for two straight years, the state legislature has cut the state park's budget. When you see the first lady out riding a zip line or at Oak Mountain or going to the caverns or going to Lake Gunnersville, you know, it brings awareness to people that might not otherwise think about that. And that includes people in the legislature. And a bucket list, you got to have it. I got a bucket list, so I'm glad she's doing it. Well, the Alabama State Park System is celebrating its 75th anniversary this year. The First Lady visited all of Alabama's 22 state parks. Nine of those were on her bucket list. In Baldwin County, James Gordon, Local 15 News. James, thanks so much. So a lot of different angles of Miss Bentley. <laughs> Does she have a smile on her face at any point? She looked like she did, you know what? And she's a lot braver than a lot of people I know. I wonder if we could get Derek Beasley up on something like There's that. There's no <laughs> way. She was, she was coming in hot. It was. It was rainy out there and kind of slick, but uh, she looked like she was having some fun. You know, the